came into my head about the uh, the generation. I don't know what they're called. The thought was um, that we surely have had to have seen the end. We call them souls. The souls who needed to be healed. It's all done now. They're already on, they're already here. And this is why you'll notice that, um, well, we were all raised pretty crazy. Pretty, a lot of single parents. We have a lot of indoctrination from the schools. The mind control is almost complete. We're, we're stuck. We can't make the changes we need to make. My thought was, um, it's been wrapped up. And, um, and now, The children that are going to come here, they're, they're basically the angels. Sure, every child kind of is seen as an angel. You all get that opportunity. I don't know what I really mean to say. It's that maybe I'm saying that whoever's coming through now... We're, these are going to be golden age children... And they, <sighs> these children are the based children. We've had some based children throughout, throughout time immemorial, people who don't really care what society has to entrain them with. It's going to be really tough. These are delicate beings. But they're gonna they're gonna be the strongest ones. Because this is the mind war. The good and evil. We'd like to say that the light has won. So that the light is won, it's all over then. It's all been finished. It's wrapped up and we watch things play out and it disclosure happens very slowly and uh, Angela Cooper has said, or is her name Diana? I think it's Angela. Diana Cooper. <laughs> yeah, that, that looks better. I think it's Diana Cooper. It suggests that the golden age starts about 2032. So, what's that, 10 more years? So you get a child born in 2019, 2018. Get a child born in 2021. Give them, just give them 10 years. Now they're gonna start talking to you and they're gonna blow your mind. Because you, the parent, has been mind controlled. The child is not going to accept the mind control that you try to put on them. And they're going to just... They start to talk. They start to think. Maybe they're beyond thinking, you know. Maybe they're just straight psychic. And... Such that they'll be able to tell you things. And that you're going to be open to continuing to love your child. Even though they, you don't understand what they're telling you. I'm saying that the... We've, I don't know. I don't know. I'm listening to videos by this artist, Thinking Ape. 
and he's often discusses uh, MGTOW, Black Pill, Romance, and the young. The young being Zoomers, he's calling them. And we're all pretty weakened. <laughs> we're all pretty weakened right now. So you got what's called Zoomers. And they look like the weakest ones yet. Some Zoomers are thinking for themselves and you find them on the incel boards talking shit on 4chan, wherever, posting funny memes and make funny songs, kind of shit posters. But like trolling and shit posting is only like one. It's kind of intelligent. It's not really intelligent though. So like. It's reactionary, I'll just say that. And you'll only get so far having a reactionary, um... Because then you end up, you're still disempowered. What I'm trying to say is that the whoever's after Zoomers, like, I think all the... For the most part, the Earth souls have been purged out. And it's weird to think that, that like, oh man, it's like we're all injured, weakened. Keep coming through, keep coming through, keep coming through. Like, we're going to heal you. You need to help heal? Come on, now's the time. We're all going to heal together. Come on, come on, heal. Everybody in. Everybody jump in and heal. <laughs> that's what our, that's what we're trying to, to accomplish is, is healing. And it's it's whoever is being born, they're the magical ones that they don't need the healing, like, and they they don't maybe they don't even have a desire to heal others. They're just they're like we're here. Mm. I don't know what that uh, what that was about, but like they're gonna come in as like the very wise. Wise to the point of like, we're not going to get damaged by your craziness. We're going to just watch you. I don't know if it's like, they're like elder watchers. Now that every, everyone has jumped in here who needs to get they, get they shit fixed. The final chance. I don't know if final. And, and... My mistake is thinking that we're all going to do it together. Obviously, it's an individual process. What I'm saying is these golden children, to some way, they're going to just be watching. In some way, they're like barely have a piece of themselves down here. They're barely in. And my suggestion is they're not even playful. We're going to be like, oh, these, they don't even play. <laughs> they're watchers. They're going, they just they're meditative. Their essence is, is emptiness. They're void children. They're Arcturian. And they're here to just uh, I don't know, it's like, maybe it's the Zen Masters when the... When the meditator starts to fall asleep, the Zen Master slaps him on the wrist, or <laughs> slap ya! <laughs> These Zen Master children are... are here... just smacking! <laughs> ah! The parents, basically. And you could say it's been like this through time. But I'm not impressed. And with uh, with some of the, the batches of children. We've never been able to revolt. 
We haven't been able to push back. We haven't been able to make changes. And I'm not going to blame boomers because I know boomers die. They're the great, greatest generation. So we have the greatest generation dies. You die in 1995 and you're and you pop back in here in 2003. You know? You get to heal again. Come on, come on, heal. So that's one way to consider it. You're like, hey man, take it, take a lap. Take a ghost lap and pop through again because so now we're kinda you're gonna be parenting your grandparents, or your great grandparents. You you parent your ancestors, and people don't people don't really think about things this way. Is is the young are clearly wiser than you. And you have more to learn from them. And you must be patient and silent and watchful. And the uh, the real parent s slowly, gently guides. To be a parent is to to to, ang to be an angel of your children. But we inher we inherit so many unwise habits through life. That. We lose sight. Some people have children and they think that, like, oh, we have, we are wise. When it's the child who's new. You need to not, not raise. This has been a frustration for me. You need to not raise your young with, for the for the world that you inherited because they are going to inherit a fresh world. They create the fresh world. So there are eternal principles that you can instill. And that would be wise parenting is, hey, you know, we got the basics and, um, To really encourage the creative capacity of your young to let them do what, let them create how they wish to create and let them change this world. We don't really let our people change this world. We overbear them. And oh, most of us here are single parents. You could say life is hard, but we make it hard. We treat each other badly, push each other around, and make this experience way more fucking hard than it difficult and broken and busted and we don't love and don't know how to love, can't get the needs met, can't get what you want, can't get what you need. You never really sit down and pray you never really sit down and th and uh, listen to your inner guidance. You never look at the book of the scripture. So try it, you know. I'd, I'd say try that. Teach, teach your new children the scriptures. On jawtruth.net, you'll find the Holy Quran and the Bible brought into one, the Gnostic Bible. The completed Bible. Very crucial. And I don't know if it's the right thing, but there's stuff in there that... that your young may have some insight on. And... So that we can learn from our young and not train them. We'll continue to be on our, be on our best way. Our way of wholeness and integrity and balance. Balance, 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 balance. And these golden children, 
I have the feeling that they're not dancing, playful, they're, they're, they're millions of years old. They're trees. The new children are trees. Let that inform your parenting. Why are you raising them like dogs? When they're trees. Alright. Rest in peace.